<laughs> uh, good morning. We are up and vlogging today. We are doing a day in the life, but it probably just ended up being a mini day in the life. I don't really know. So anyways, I've already gotten up and gotten my shower this morning because that's basically what I do four days a week now because we have activities in the mornings. And Natalie is up eating her food. I poked my head in to wake up Isabella and I got the covers over the head. <laughs> so she's going to lay in there for a little while longer. <laughs> so we're going to get breakfast and today Bella has school. So we're going to get ready this morning and get all of our school things ready. And so I don't know how much I'll be vlogging because it's the first time I've tried to vlog and do it. But um, we'll just kind of do a little mini day in the life vlog today. <laughs> and Natalie has awesome morning hair. <laughs> Uh, it's kind of like part curly, part not curly today. So, so we are up and going. Everyone is, <laughs> and I had to start the dishwasher because we were running it last night, but it was too loud to watch the movie. Even though this thing says Quiet Partner on it, I think I don't know what brand it is. Whirlpool. Um, even though it says Quiet in the title of the. <laughs> dishwasher my husband took the decibel meter over to it last night and it was like 88 decibels which is pretty loud for dishwashers we've actually been looking at dishwashers for the new house and they are pretty quiet now like the decibel ratings are like 48 or something like that and we're gonna have the same problem at that house where the kitchen is like right near the kind of movie area at night so hopefully they'll be quieter would you like your socks on Isabella <laughs> are you excited about going to school today yeah? It's a very fun day when you get to go to school, huh? <laughs> yes, it's a very fun day for you, too. Yes, Natalie is very excited as well. And tell Mommy what your new favorite word is. What's your new favorite word? Natalie, can you say yes? No. Mm-hmm. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Every two-year-old's favorite word, and Natalie officially yeah. says it constantly. Oh yeah, you need to go potty. <laughs> That's the other thing. Why do you want to go potty, Natalie? What do you want to get when you go potty? <laughs> he runs around the house going, I go potty. Get out of them. Oh, bear huggies. Are you chatty today or no? I'm not. You're not. I'm not. You're not. <laughs> you talk to me later. That's fine. Not. Do you see clouds? Yeah. Are up they high. up high? Yep, clouds up high. Uh, 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 Are you ready to get down? Are you all done? Yeah. Done? Yeah. Yes. All right, so we're gonna do Bella's hair. We're attempting a new hairdo here. She, we've been doing it like the weekend and last week a few times. I just basically put a braid right here on her hair and it keeps it out of her face really nicely, but I'm not that good at it, so. We're gonna try it this morning. It'll be the first school day that we've done. Show me your Rapunzel braid. It's <laughs> not the greatest, but it'll do. There we go. Ta da! <laughs> <laughs> so, Natalie has her little backpack, and we did end up. Show me your backpack real quick. Getting this little bit larger one. So, this one is the small size backpack. And it actually fits her really well. I mean, the dimensions seem like they are gonna be big, but. You can tell that the small fits Bella well and the mini fits Natalie well. So we are off. Yeah. All right, so we are off. We're gonna go drop Bella off at school and then I am gonna go run some errands with Natalie. All right, so Bella is off at school and Natalie and Mommy are gonna go on an adventure, otherwise known as go to Target. <laughs> Natalie's enjoying her solo time. We can roll around in one cart, hooray. All right, so we are enjoying our one-on-one -on -one errand time. We just ran into Target, and Natalie is having a little snack back there. She's enjoying having the back seat all to herself. So I picked up, I saw this really cute coat, and I thought that this would be a great like transitional coat thing. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to show it. I'll probably just show it at home. Anyways, it's kind of like a light champagne color, and I've been talking about on my other channel how I've been going towards like lighter things this fall for like mainly in the fall and winter I would always go towards like navies and grays and blacks like you know like what I'm wearing right now but I've been wanting to put more like lighter colors in my wardrobe this year for whatever reason like I got this bag that's a lighter color Oops, it's got something stuck to it and um 
so anyhow I'm just trying to find things like that and I saw this coat in Target and I need more like transitional coats you know in the fall when you don't need like a heavy like wool coat like pea coat but uh, I saw this and I like this color so I'll show you that at home when I can open it up then we also got Natalie this little picnic basket um, this was something that they actually had at the therapist's office when we were still going there she used it like the last time we were there and it's by Leapfrog Probably should have done this at home. <laughs> Sorry. Anyhow, it's this little picnic basket thing. It's by Leapfrog, and it's got these cute little um, like shapes that you can sort. And she loved it. And the therapist called it productive play. So I'm wanting to get more like productive play items for Natalie because when I really started looking around, we have a lot of pretend play items where they can use their imagination and that's really good. But as far as like productive play where they're physically having to stick something in something and maneuver it around and more like puzzles. I mean, we have the building blocks. But I wanted to get more like puzzle things for Natalie because they had like four different shape sorters at the therapist's office and she loved all of them. We have one different shape sorter, but um, you know, the shapes go on the side. But I'm wanting to try to find something the shapes go down in the top of it too because I think Natalie would benefit from that. Um, she's super quick at them. Natalie has shapes, you know, shape sorting mastered. But they just said that productive play is really good for their minds. You know, even though it seems like the sensory issues may go away for Natalie um, because they were being driven on by her um, ears being off or not being able to hear all the way, it's just really good at those times when it's taking her longer to wake up or um, you know, just when she needs like a task to do those productive play things. So anyways, I'm gonna start looking for some of those. So if you have any suggestions, let me know down below. And we are gonna go run to Bath and Body Works, I think, real quick and just enjoying our errand time. And Natalie is gonna start doing some activities during these, you know, like times when I have her just by myself. But we're just enjoying a few weeks here of just doing whatever we want is very nice. <laughs> so probably Thursday we'll go home and do some preschool at home. And then also I'm, she can't do swimming right away. I think we need to wait at least six months because of the tubes to do swim class. She loves swimming, but we'll probably wait until after Christmas to get back into swim class with her. Um, but I'm thinking about having her try toddler soccer. Do you guys remember my vlogs from a while ago? Bella's done a couple sessions of that. So I think that should be a hoot with just Natalie. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go to Bath and Body Works and then uh, go pick up Bella in a bit. Are you driving? Hi. You driving the ice cream truck? You driving the car? Look at mommy. Did it honk at you? <laughs> Alright, we gotta go get Sissy. We gotta go get in our car to go get Sissy. Alright, so we are back at the house and finishing up lunch. I actually stopped at Panera drive through on the way home and we had Greek salad and turkey panini. So we are going to finish up lunch and then it's going to be rest time not too long because we're hopefully going to a play place this afternoon. Bella, did you have fun at school today? Yeah, what was your favorite part about today, Isabella? Did you like playing outside? Inside the place. What letter did you talk about today? B. B. Bye. B is for Bella. <laughs> Are you done over there? I think Natalie's done. She's tossing food everywhere. All right, so we're going to clean up here from lunch, and then it'll be rest time. So both the kids are down for nap and rest time and should be hopefully just a couple hours and then it's a quick turnaround. We're planning on going out to the play place, hopefully if they both wake up from naps and we get going in time um, to go to the indoor play place with the mom's group. And I tell you what, it goes quick. Whenever you're just doing pickups, drop offs in the morning, you think, oh, like two hours, I have all this time to do stuff. It goes so quick, like the days just have gone super quick. All through September has been really quick. So I'm going to put away the things that we got this morning. I'll show you real quick what I got at Bath and Body Works and what that coat looks like. And then I'm going to try to do some editing and get a video posted up today. I need to upload a video. So that's what I'm going to do during the majority of nap time. I also need to vacuum. And then we will be going out to the play place. All 
All right, I'm gonna deal with putting away all this stuff real quick, but this is the jacket that I got. You can see it's just like a little puffer jacket, and I really like the champagne color. This is at Target. I thought it was actually like around $29.99, but then I got it up to the register, and it was a little bit more expensive. It was $39.99, but I went ahead and got it because I did really like it. I tried it on, and I liked it. So that's this like nice champagne color. And then this is the little picnic basket that I got Natalie, and it has just a couple different like sound options and everything gets stored in there. But the thing that I mainly got this for were these little shape sorting plates. She loved these. And then it's got little cuffs that go with it, some silverware, and then everything stores down inside of here. So I thought that this was a cute little toy. And then this didn't, I didn't get this in the mail today, but this just needs to go upstairs, but it was here. So I figured I'd show, this is something that I got on resale from one of the groups, the Magical Dreams Come True group. One of the designers had this. It was a resale that her daughter had used. So I went ahead and got this, and um, it says Preschool Rocks, obviously, on it. And purple is, seems to be Bella's favorite color right now. So this was perfect for us. It's the size that Bella is going into, and it came with this little headband, even though I don't really know that that's something that we will wear because it's just a little bit fancier, as Bella says, or floofier. But, I don't know, maybe at some point it'll be appropriate. So anyhow, she got this little preschool rock shirt. And I had been looking at those, but I just didn't get one brand new. So I was happy to find one and resell. That was perfect, because I would have ordered her purple anyways. And then at Bath & Body Works, they are having a sale. So I went ahead and got the um, antibacterial soap. Um, and a couple of the fall flavors, scents, I say flavors, but it's a scent. Um, the pumpkin cupcake I think is one of my favorites. I also like the pumpkin caramel latte, and then I also got one in creamy pumpkin. I'll just use those in our bathrooms throughout the house. And then their candles were also on sale, and they were two for 22, so I went ahead and got leaves, which is one of my favorite fall scents, and these are the really big candles. They're uh, three wick candles. I don't burn candles a lot. I, if I might put these on like one of those little warmer things, but I went ahead and got these because they were on super sale. This one's pumpkin cupcake, and this one smells really, really good. And that's what the color looks like. So I got those. They were two for 22. Then I also got this little mini candle in the pumpkin cupcake. It smells so good. It's just like, it smells like a pumpkin cupcake. It's pretty much exactly what it smells like. And I'm going to have my little girl room or whatever you want to call it, my dressing room at the new house. So I thought like even if I want to put like one of these in my dressing room, it's going to be a cat free and kid free type of room. It might be able to get a little bit more use in there. So I got those and I also had a 20% off coupon. So everything actually ended up being a really decent price. Um, I think it was like $30 for all this stuff. So really that's not bad for four soaps, two big candles, and then I got this little mini candle for free, and they let me use two coupons at once. So, I don't know, I thought it was a pretty good deal. So that's what I got at Bath & Body Works. So I'm gonna go put all this stuff away and then try to get to some editing. So Bella is awake and eating her snacks, and we're just waiting for Sissy to wake up, and we are going to go to the play place. The mommy's taking a giant bag of baby clothes to one of our friends in our mom's group who is expecting a little girl. So, We'll get those out of here before the move, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes, you're too big for it. It's for the baby. She's going to put her baby in it. Okay? It's for elephant. Yep, good reading. And she's for giraffe. Do you remember that used to play music for Sissy? We used to put Sissy in there. It's too big for her, or she's too big for it now. She honestly probably would still put it, but... We won't let her see it. <laughs> Are you bouncing? <laughs> Hi, Bella. Can you wave? <laughs> No, she's changed her mind. Up. Did you find the air blower? Go on, go in there and jump. Natalie. I have a distinct feeling I'm gonna end up having to climb into this thing before long. <laughs> 
What are you doing all the way down there? Hi there. Mommy's in the middle of the plaything. This is Mommy in the plaything. Hi. You going down the slide? Here comes Sissy. We are back home from the play place and I'm making dinner real quick. It is extremely late. It's after 6 o'clock, which is a lot later than we usually get back, but the kids were having fun playing. So I'm making a quick dinner. I'm just making some ravioli on the stove and it's going to put some pesto on over it and then we'll have dinner real quick and then probably just a little bit of playtime and it'll be bedtime already. So that was a quick day. All right, so that's it for our vlog of what felt like to me a whirlwind day. We got home and ate dinner and basically went upstairs and played for about five minutes before it was bath time and time to get down to bed and everything. So now the kids are in bed and a few potty stops later for Bella. I think they are down for good for the evening. So I'm going to go ahead and start working on getting the dishwasher unloaded and loaded. And that is it for my night as well. So hopefully you guys enjoyed today's vlog. We'll be back with some more Day in the Life later on in September. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.